Hey guys, sorry for the relatively poor sound quality. Um, so I made one comment on one Gerard Butler post and I have been inundated. So first of all, was management representative, right, for Gerard Butler and he actually rang me. So, hello, this is the media representative of Gerard Butler management team. I was asked to come in here to let you know to always block and delete any fake profile claiming to be him. I hope to get a respond from you on time. I said, hi, what about fake management teams with poor English? Should I block them as well, you think? And this scammer actually understood sarcasm. You're mean, he said. My response was, aww. And then obviously audio call started, which you'll see in the previous video. The audio quality was not great. Um, and then he sent a photo, which I can't access anymore, of Gerard Butler, as if that's going to convince me. But wait, that's not all. So meet fan page, the real Gerard Butler chats. Hello, dear Rose. This is Gerard Butler, Jerry in brackets. Thanks so much for the morale push. It has been your prayers and support that has kept me at my best. May the good Lord bless and guide you, smiley face. I said, sure, thanks. Love heart. You're welcome. I appreciate your love and support. I said, honestly, I haven't seen your last few films. Really, he said. You can go watch them. I bet you'll love them. I said, maybe. I much preferred Phantom. I love that. I'd love to hear about what it was like to work with Sir Andrew, referring to Andrew Lloyd Webber, of course, and to audition for Gene Kelly. I mean, oh my God. Thanks. Big smiley face. It was nice. Where are you from? I said, nice. That's it. LOL. I said, I'm from Australia. I was hoping you'd have stories, fun and interesting ones. Of course, he said. I said, well, you went away. And obviously I reported it. I don't think he'll come back. But wait, there's more. Meet Jerry. Instagram of Gerard Butler. Hello, gorgeous. How are you? My name's uh, Gerard James Butler. I'm a Scottish actor and producer. You were suggested to me here on my private page while I was replying to a chat from a family member, as this is my private page where I only relate with a few friends and family members. I must confess that you really look beautiful. What's your beauty secret? I would be delighted to get a response from you soon. Yours sincerely, Jerry. So how could I resist? I said, hi there. I just got a scam warning from Instagram when I went to accept this request. Don't they know who's, a, a, don't they know this is your account? Question mark, question mark. Are you less busy, he said, so I can call you on video chat for you to see me. Now I was kicking myself because I was actually at work. There was no way for me to record anything. I said, only if you say my name, answer when I ask you a question and scratch your nose. Oh, and your mouth and voice had better be synced up. Maybe a voice call would be better now that I think about it. I only want to see your face. If you're interested in me doing all that, then I, though, okay, you should feature me in a movie. Side eye. I said, what? What does I, though, okay, you should feature me in a movie mean? I'm just ensuring that I'm actually going to have a conversation with you over video and not have some BS clip played. Up to you. I would much prefer a voice call. Otherwise, forget it. And then he corrected himself, I think, to tell me that I should be making him do a movie. And he rang me, but I was literally at work and I couldn't answer it. I said, give me 20 minutes. I'm at work. I'll call you back. It's 1.50 p.m. here and I'm in a meeting. I said, I can't wait to hear that sexy Scottish accent of yours. I'll be out of this meeting in 20 minutes. I really wanted to get this one. Okay, he said. I said, I'm calling you now. I'm trying to call you and it wasn't going through. And it wasn't. It just wouldn't go through. I said, never mind then. I don't have all day. Now, he's seen that half an hour ago. It's early morning in Nigeria. So I'm just going to keep the phone handy in case he rings. Though I've got a weird feeling that that may have been the management team that just rang me then because he, the timing was just too coincidental from when that um, 
phone conversation came through. So, yeah, that's lots of Gerard Butlers and lots of failures. And don't worry, the Bon Jovi video is still coming out. Okay, bye.